Was this the one I was on earlier? Oh no, this is the one I was originally going to look at. Alright. Glacial planet. My favorite. Bar Sentinel's great. I well, don't think I'm gonna find much here unless I happen to get lucky and they see one flying around. my time here. I guess I'll just have to see if any of the other planets in the system are high security. came from I think that's the one I just came from what about this one It's a scorched planet. Uh, what about this one? It's the paradise planet. Unknown. Incandescent. All right. I guess we'll see if, what we can find on this planet, and if there's nothing of interest, I might call the session here. We'll see. Antimatter is good. I don't think I really have a lot of Fecium. Huh, alright. I like the idea of random NPCs sort of showing up as you're traveling around the planetary systems. It makes it seem a little bit less like you're by yourself. Well, it's my hope for future updates in No Man's Sky that they flesh out the space exploration a little bit. Maybe change or build out the way encounters and 
space pirate battles and all that other stuff. I think they could do a lot with that to make it more interesting. Alright. Sparse Sentinels again. Uh... Interesting layout, though. This is a high temperature planet or a volcanic planet, maybe? That's an interesting looking plant. I don't think I'm going to find Sentinels here. I may have to just port to another system. I think I'll do that. Conflict level, perilous, declining, economy. Conflict level is space pirates, I think. Well, we'll take a look. I don't know if higher conflict systems are a higher chance to be higher security, but I guess we'll find out. Humid planet. I wish it it told me the security level from space. But I don't think there's a way to see that. Or if there is, I don't know how to do it. But we'll go ahead and touch down and see. Moderate to high security should be good enough. Sentinels low. So not sparse. But low means there's not going to be a high chance of running into them, I think. Well, I guess I can look around a little bit. And if I don't see anything, I might call it here. I'm fine taking care of the ancillary side quest to up upgrade our standing off camera. I don't feel like that's a super critical thing to do as part of this particular recording session. I'm just hoping to get a little bit more progression through the main storyline. That's okay. If you look at our quest log, there's a funky looking alien. We have the Atlas Path, which 
It's sort of a parallel storyline to the Artemis one. But we'll see if we can get enough progression to up our standing and then all that'll allow us to move through the Artemis line. There's also some basic base building ones and I'll need to work more on the Starbirth quest line. That'll sort of be going on in the background since it requires actual time for things to happen. Alright. Try one more planet before I call this a session. Sub-Zero Planet. Oh, another merchant? Uh, I don't, don't see anything of note in there. Pirates want to pick a fight with me. They should be pretty easy to deal with my weaponry here. Hitting point blank with the positron ejector. Pretty easy. I think as I start moving further throughout the system, I'll start running into more difficult encounters. Oh, Shattered Planet. That wasn't the one I was looking at. one or is this one no oh, that's where I just was where's the sub-zero planet is it this one yeah all right oh, my freighters in another system right high sentinel activity all right if we cause enough trouble on this planet we should be able to complete our mission hopefully I don't regret causing direct conflict with sentinels but we'll see <laughs> 